Welcome to the Melodyne Editor Tour about transfer of audio data into Melodyne Editor plugin. Open the desired project in your host software and position the host playback cursor at a point before the desired passage. Load Melodyne Editor plugin as an audio insert effect in the audio track you wish to edit. You get best results with a dry and clean input signal, so positioning it above any insert effects in the channel is a good idea. Click the Transfer button in Melodyne Editor. Press Play in the host, and Melodyne starts importing the audio data. Let me show you how to find your way back to your waiting star. We will be there when we come to our sleepless hearts. Stopping the host or clicking the transfer button automatically stops the transfer and starts the analysis of the data by Melodyne Editor. We just transferred part of an acoustic guitar track into Melodyne Editor plugin. Transfer of audio passages of any length into Melodyne Editor can be started and stopped at any time with the host running, and even simultaneously with several instances of the plugin. During playback, those passages that have been transferred to Melodyne Editor will be played back by Melodyne Editor, all others by the host. Choose Show Replace Ranges from the View menu. Now all passages that will be played back by Melodyne Editor are marked. Such regions can be extended simply by dragging their borders with the mouse. To shorten a playback region, delete a few blobs and select Snap Replace Ranges to Notes from the Context menu of the bar ruler. Now you know how to transfer audio data in Melodyne Editor plugin and how to handle the playback ranges. Hit pause in your video player if you need more time with the summary.